In this video, we're going to take a look at the Com Abstracts database, which is a product of the Communication Institute for Online Scholarship. To access the database, begin on the library homepage, and under the Find tab, click on the link that says Articles. Scroll through the list of topics and look for Communications. And then in the list of Communication Databases, look for Com Abstracts. Click on the link to enter the database. By default, you'll be taken to the advanced search page where you have a number of search options. You can enter your search in the first box using any sort of Boolean operator. You can tell the database how you would like to search, including by author or keyword or a number of other options. By default, the database searches for synonyms for your words, so the example they use here, if you search for movie, it would also look for cinema. But you can turn to choose this option off. The last two limiting options, including the ability to limit to a particular journal that is indexed in this database. So for example, I could search in just communication monographs. And then I can also set the date range. So right now the default is set to 1900 to 2011. I could change this to 1990, for example. So I'm going to enter the search uh, gender and interpersonal communication and click the Submit button at the bottom of the page. On the next page, you'll have your search results, where you have the authors listed as well as the basic publication information. To view more information about the article, click on the link that says View Full Record and Link Options. And then you should have a record for this page, which includes the citation, the abstract, and the affiliation of the author, as well as some keywords and meta terms. At the bottom of the page, you have options for keeping track of the, your research. You can email the record to yourself, just entering your name into the box. You can also view a printer-friendly version if you prefer to print out the page. Then you can also use the Find a Link, in which you would just click on the link, and it open up a new tab to see if we have a subscription to the full text of this article in another OU Libraries database. This tells me that we do actually have a subscription to this article at Informal World. So I just click on the link and I should shortly have the full text of the article. There isn't any full text of the articles in the Com Abstracts database, so whenever you want to read the article, you will want to use the Find It button. So now we're on the Informal World page, and here I have access to the PDF and the HTML version of this article because we subscribe to this journal through Informal World. That's been a quick look at the database Com Abstracts and its search options. If you have any questions, feel free to let me know.